I don't understand some women. Okay, some of us, let me include myself. But the worst part is, you have a problem with your man. You disgrace him in the public. You insulted his pride as a man. You insulted his manhood. You tell the whole world how small his manhood is. You screenshotted it and put it online. You insulted, like, I don't understand. Do you think when a man has finished seeing your nakedness, you have any respect anymore? Do you know how, how good it is, how, feel, how you feel when you know that this man has not seen your nakedness? Do you know how, how it feels when a man has not seen your nakedness as a woman? See, even in as much as we are the Gen Z, we are, we are so shameless. But at times, let us tell ourselves the truth. There is, a, there is a way when a man has not seen your body, how you will feel. And there is a, there is a way after he has seen all how, you, how your body is. You people have slept together. There is a different feelings. Do you think you are anything when a man has finished seeing how your nakedness is? You insulted men. I don't know why you feel if a man has small bola, it's a humiliating something. No, you have a problem, not this man. When a man has a small bola, he does not have any problem. As long as this bola can produce, you have a problem. You know, let me tell you something as a woman. Let us be honest here. Yeah? There's no bias. It can happen to me. Let me put myself into there is a in fact where you have where you have so many sides, or when you start get to a point where you are no longer satisfied with small bola, let the small bola not be satisfied you with you, but not you not being satisfied with small bola. There's a point where you start to accumulate all those things. You start to have a mental. You have, you start you don't you don't longer even have you don't even know what you want. You don't have taste again for good things, because you know why you have mixed up a lot of things. See, when you eat salad, you don't know which of the leaf that is sweeter. Inside the salad, you don't know if it's cucumber. Which one is the best? All of them it tastes somehow because all of them the taste have combined together. So you don't, it, it becomes to something. That's why it, it's called salad. So there's a time in your life where you start to take all those things, where you start to be with so many men, right? You, you don't even know what you want, what is good again for your mental health. You don't even know. You became very confused. It starts to affect your mental health, your, your way of thinking, your way of thinking. Like I don't understand when a man comes to you, if you for the first play before going to bed, you have to see each other how it is before he will put his toto inside your inside your quakus. Please tell him your bola is too small. I can no longer. Not after when you people you will be there. You will be there after you had problem. You think you want to humiliate the man to make him feel like because your bola is too small. You want to humiliate the man. And at the end of the day, you carry your shameless self to go and open your legs on this man again. You after humiliating him that his bola is too small. At the end of the day, you open your and drop. Maybe this young drought cannot even produce your draw. This young drought is of no use. You still go and open it again to this man. For this man to knock your drought. If I am the man, I will finish knock your drought and I'm pa. I'll spit in it. Yes, I'll spit in it. I don't know what women are feeling like. You think uh, because a man has a small bowler, you it's a, it's a problem. It's not a problem, my dear. Men, listen to me and listen very carefully. Let no woman uh, pressure you unless you choose to walk away. Uh, I feel like my bola is too small for this pecus. But let no woman, you are not the cause of her, her wild bold. You are not her, you are not the problem. The problem is her because you know why? We tasted a lot of things and sometimes I cannot blame us because the men too, they don't want to stay. Yes, they don't, they, the men too, they don't want to stay. When a man don't want to take you see or you don't want to get married to you, it's not your fault. But it should not be something that you have to start to blame another man. So I don't know why men start feeling bad when a woman still make you to feel like, oh, today, after you are going to take a lash man. You see, if my body has fallen, if I want to take a, a breast to, if I want to take something to lift it up, right? If I want to, or to make it a lash, to a lash it, 
let me tell you something by my choice it's not because a man tells me to do so i want to do something for myself so that when the side effects start to come i will i will i'll, I'll be all accountable i will take responsibility for my action not start blaming somebody i did this because of you i did that because of you you were the one who pushed me no i won't have anybody to blame so if you want to do something do it for yourself no don't do it because of any woman you understand what i'm telling you men i don't know why women will start to put you pressure can you impregnate a woman yes You think yeah after after all those all those things you go again to open your legs are you no shame as a woman you are supposed to have small shame there's one time in your life have small atom of shame even me that I'm, I'm shameless sometimes I do have shame some of you girls you are so shameless gosh get out of my 